Well, there are three important points to note. Uh, the Malaysian government's announcement impacts both work pass holders as well as our own citizens and permanent residents who commute daily. Uh, many of these workers are hired by companies that provide essential services such as healthcare, security, cleaning, transportation, waste management, facilities management and logistics. Even for companies uh, which do not uh, provide essential services, they employ Singaporeans so we want to ensure that their businesses are not severely disrupted. This is why MOM has been working with our tripartite partners to support the affected companies. If they need the workers to stay in Singapore, and the way to do so is to help them find suitable accommodation. There are a number of housing options. Uh, we have issued an advisory on this. First, the employers can encourage their affected workers to stay with their relatives, friends or colleagues in Singapore who may be able and willing to accommodate them for a short period. Now, this option is probably the most comfortable to the affected workers. Second, if staying with um, relatives, friends or colleagues is not feasible, then the employers can consider hotel and dormitories. We have a list and we will link them up. The third option will be rental options and there are real estate agents who can help. Uh, whatever the arrangements, we appreciate that uh, businesses have had to respond very quickly and incurred some additional costs as a result. Therefore, we have worked out uh, financial support. For every affected worker, we will provide the firms with a support of $50 per night for 14 nights. More details on how to apply will be announced subsequently.